welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Danny, and this is Coffee Break with Danny. I am super excited to have my monthly favorites here for you guys. It is actually sponsored by Native. You guys know how I feel about Native deodorant. It is no secret around here that your girl needs to use deodorant. I took a long and arduous journey to find a clean, just simple deodorant, but also made sure I didn't stink after a few hours, okay? So today we are going to talk about what I've been loving, including my new pro hack for one of my favorite native products. All right, so if you guys are new around here, which you're not, you are already very familiar that I'm a huge fan of native products. So today we are going to offer you guys the same promotion we did last time. Do you guys remember the best sellers pack for $24? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna show you what I got with my best sellers pack and then I'm gonna kind of get into why I love native so much. Okay, so for my best sellers pack this time around, I got the Sweet, Sweet Peach and Nectar deodorant and body spray. That's this guy right here. And you know how I feel about Sweet Peach? <sighs> Sweet Peach is one of my favorite scents. I also got the Aloe and Green Tea Body Wash. Sometimes I get this one, sometimes I get the Mint Cucumber scent because does anyone else have a husband that experiments in the shower with their products? And by experiments, I mean forgets to tell their wife that they ran out of body wash so they use theirs and their scents are so awesome because they're all super friendly. I mean, they have a scent for everyone. And then I got the Sweet Peach and Nectar Classic Deodorant. All right, so this is my pack. This is what I picked. These are my restock scents. These are the ones that I love. Honestly, like I mix it up with the scents, but they all work really well together. I love them. They're clean, they're simple, they're effective. So the classic guy gives me 72 hours of protection. It also comes in a sensitive variety. Then with the body wash, it gives you the most delicious, awesome, fluffy bubbles. And then I got this guy. Okay, so this guy's cool. And here's where my pro hack comes in handy. So my son, both of my sons play baseball, but my older son is doing a lot of tournaments. And if you're not familiar with baseball tournaments, they last all day and they're usually two days. So we'll be there from like 7 a.m. to sometimes 7, 8 p.m. We're there all day. And this is something that I've actually put in my bag along with snacks, along with sunscreen, a hat, etc., etc. But because I leave in such a hurry sometimes and we're scrambling to get like your lawn chairs and your cooler and their gear and their cleats and their this and your hat, whatever, like I'm like, did I put on deodorant? And there are times where I literally roll out of bed put on sweatpants, sweatshirt, a jacket, hot hands, cause it's freezing. And I'm like, did I put on, did I put a perfume today? I don't feel like I smell good. And obviously I dig in here and I, I don't smell. You guys, 72 hours, that's a long time, but I'm really not gonna put it to the test. Like a girl has to shower, you know? But I'll be like, I don't smell good. I always have this in my bag because not only is it good as a deodorant, but it doubles as a mist, like a fragrance mist. So now I smell delicious and nobody needs to know that I left in a hurry or if I forgot to put on deodorant or being worried or nervous that I might smell like pits, I don't because it has my back and it only has six ingredients. So whether or not you smell very interesting like I do if you don't use deodorant or you have somebody that is in your family that is on an adventure to find a clean, simple, easy, cruelty-free and vegan deodorant line, tell them that you have their shower covered from start to finish. So if you guys are fans of Native, take advantage of the promo they have going on right now because you can get their best sellers pack for $24. That's a savings of 33%. If you use the code coffeebreak2, I'll leave the link in the description box below and look out for their holiday scents. You guys, every holiday, thanks to you guys, I discovered sugar cookie. I get a few of those every year at the end of the year because I want to smell like sugar cookie for an extended period of time. And it is limited edition, so they also have candy cane, they have sugar cookie, I'm not sure what. They have more scents in the collection, but those are the two that I've tried. So look out for those scents now. But whether you have like a super woodsy, oceany smelling spouse or husband in your life that you want to introduce to a cleaner, de my husband's a fan now. He's like, hey, uh, you know the agave one? I'm like, of course I know the agave one. I found it, I found it for you. He's a fan as well. So this whole family, native users, clean, simple, and effective. 
All the information will be listed in the description box below. You're welcome for my pro hack. This is awesome to just throw in your bag, you guys, for the days that you forget to either put on deodorant or to put on perfume because it's a two in one. You know what I mean? Okay, you know what I, you always know what I mean. Let's continue talking about smell good stuff. I discovered this totally on accident when I was at Target the other day. It's one of those Glen, Glade, Glen, Glade plugins, but the scent that I found, I think it's cashmere woods. I'll link it in the description box. Everything that I mentioned, everything that I'm wearing will be listed in the description box, along with the promo code and the link to the native best-selling pack. This is what this little guy looks like. You just put it in, I like to put this in like a wide open space, never in really small rooms because they can be pretty potent, but it has a little dial here where you can do lots of scent, little scent, but they're actually super, like they actually work. They actually work and they're not, you know, assaulting with the fragrance. A lot of times with plugins like this or scented products, you really can't caliber or control the amount of scent that comes out. And with this little dial, I usually have them turned down almost to the lowest setting. <sighs> they make my house smell so yummy. I think I only have two, two or three in my house. One in the entrance one in this hallway and one upstairs. Yeah, just in the open and it's enough to make my whole house smell good. And I can tell you that because my friend Edema walks through my house after we pick up the kids from school, like she does a shortcut and she's like, oh, it smells so good in here. I was like, thank you, thank you. Is it me? No, it's, you. it's, it's usually this. Or I don't know, it might be this. <laughs> okay, so a little bit of some fashion finds. This jumper that I'm wearing right now, I will insert a picture of what the full length of it looks like. It's like a leather inspired jumper. It has a zipper that goes all the way to the bottom, so be careful. It has pockets and it also comes in black. I love the look of leather in the fall and winter. It's a big fashion statement, but also it doesn't have a hefty price tag because I got it at Target. I know. Cute. Another thing I discovered at Target, I'll show you what it looks like on because I feel like my hair looks cute right now. I don't want to mess it up. I found this hat. I've been using a lot of hats. Thanks, baseball, out in the sun for hours. Hats and sunglasses together sometimes can be a bad combo and make my ears or my head hurt. This one doesn't, so it's been tested. But the reason that I like this one, besides the neutral distressed color of it, is the B. So I'm not sure if you guys know the story or the fact or what, I don't even know what to call it. But supposedly what scientists say is that the bee is the only living creature on this planet that defies all rules of like gravity or physics or nature or whatever. That they're the only living thing that should not be able to support their weight with how small their wings are. So they are given to people as like good luck charms or I'm thinking about you gifts or just this sort of, they're on keychains because it's sort of like a, a symbol of you should believe in yourself. You know, miracles do exist, miracles do happen. And sometimes there doesn't need to be a reason or an explanation for things. You just have to believe and that's good enough. I butchered this entire story really bad. So I'm gonna try and find something cute, a little printout or something and put it on the screen because sometimes as as much as I pride myself as, as a person that can explain really well, sometimes I, I do this. I had to have it when I saw it at Target, you guys, I had to. I don't know how to begin with the rest of these things because it just gets more and more random. Stressless beans, I talked about this in a vlog. These are some uh, jelly bean vitamins. They're basically some really delicious jelly beans that help your body be more emotionally balanced. If you guys have been watching the vlogs or you know what's going on or follow on Instagram, you know that it's been real stressful, real stressful around here. I wasn't a believer in like gummy vitamins or chewy vitamins. I like, I just, you know, I just something fast, something that tastes good and just fast. And so when I tried these, I don't know, I, I think I'm a bee, I think I'm believing in it. So I wanted to mention those in case you didn't see that vlog, they are delicious, there is no aftertaste, and maybe they are the reason why I've been handling life so well, despite the fact that I'm a firm believer I should not be handling it this well. Maybe it's growth. <laughs> maybe I'm a grown up now. Okay, 
super random. I talked about this game in a Walmart reel that I did a couple of weeks ago. And originally I was going to give this to the boys as a Christmas present because we love playing video games together, especially the ones that involve like physical activity, like the sports, well, the Wii sports. But I grew up on Mario, I'm an 80s kid, 80s and 90s. And so when I heard that there was a new Super Mario Brothers game, I jumped on it, got it right away, and I, as an almost 40 year old adult, could not wait until Christmas. So we opened it and it is so fun, you guys. So Super Mario Brothers Wonder, highly recommend if you like to play video games as a fan. I don't, you don't even need to play with people. So here's a secret. So the boys have to go to their dads sometimes, you know, and I sometimes play by myself. It is a four player game, up to four player game, and you all play at the same time. So it is interactive. You can also go online with it, which we don't. It's really fun. It reminds me of very old school Mario, but up to date, current, you know, cool with the Riz. I don't know, it's bussin'. There you go. I'm talking like a middle schooler now. Definitely recommend that. This would be a great Christmas gift or a great self care gift for yourself if you like to unwind at the end of the day and play your Switch, like I do. I definitely do that. Okay, let's talk about two <laughs> random beauty products, beauty tools. Let's talk about beauty tools. I think I've already talked about this guy, but I wanna mention it again because for some reason, my uh, hormonal mustache gets thicker in the winter. So I am a woman that does uh, go to women with mustaches support group. And I'm okay with that. I talk about it all the time. I don't care. It's part of who I am. And listen, we're all we're all humans and we all are covered in body hair. Some of us just have the benefit of being able to do this with theirs. So this little guy is so good, you guys, for your face, for, I don't know, your unibrow, for your mustache. It is so good, but it is sharp, so you have to be careful. And I think one of the reasons I like it is because it is pretty heavy so you can hold it very well. It's very sturdy and it's refillable. So these little guys here are refillable. You keep this and you just keep buying refills. You know, mine, my mustache is pretty thick so it dulls the blade pretty fast. It, do it doesn't, it lasts a while. Just make sure to keep the cover on it. Make sure to keep it clean because if this is touching your face, you'll have to be real careful. There are other areas of the body that sometimes require maintenance and landscaping. This guy here is so good. Look, I don't appreciate it being marketed to just men because now I have a tool that's called Manscaped and it makes me feel some type of way. I know that we have way more products targeted at us, but you know what I also know? We pay the pink tax. They don't. That's all I'm gonna talk about emotionally in this video. We're done with that. But this little guy is a great trimmer for a lot of things. Whether it's targeted at manscaping or not, you can be creative with it. If that's what you want it for, it's good. If you have little dogs that require just like in between grooming maintenance, it's good for that. If you have really hairy arms that make you feel like Chewbacca's your dad, it's good for that. I, I'm not saying I do. I just let I just let I just let flow. Like this is what it is, and this is what I have, and, and I leave it alone. I leave it alone. I made the mistake of shaving my arms when I was in middle school once, and I really regret it. Thank you for letting me get that off my chest. <laughs> but if you guys are looking for a good set, a good trimmer for just a random random amount of reasons, you think I think you know what I'm talking about. It's really good for that, and you can actually so the guard. It can be long or short. I always keep it at like the shortest. And it has a light. See that? And it's waterproof, which I think is a little weird, but it is waterproof and it's rechargeable. So this has been a really, really good investment. And I also love that it comes apart. So if you want to um, take it apart and like actually clean it properly, oh, that's not a good sign of me clean. It, it comes apart. Just close your eyes, pretend you didn't see anything gonna bow my head in shame for a second, put it away so I don't lose any parts. All right, let's talk about makeup. So excited about this. Three of these products are on my face at the moment. So let's talk about the Milani Cream Blushes. This is the Cheek Kiss in Nude Kiss. It's the cream blush that's on my face right now. You're just looking at the highlighter, aren't you? I topped it with Laura Mercier's One. Shade One of the highlighters, the baked, that's on top of it. But this guy, 
so good oh my gosh a lot of you guys have asked about cream blush alternatives because i'm always talking about prestige brands of cream blushes this is a really great one as great as i think i might need other colors of it just putting it out there a new mascara from flower beauty that i actually discovered doing a pr unboxing like can you see can you see my lashes I don't know how to properly show, let me look down. I don't know how to properly show mascara in video because when I'm showing you my eyes, I can't actually be looking. Anyway, this is a volumizing mascara that's supposed to feel cloudy, meaning you can't feel it. Homegirl here is a fan of tarantula lashes. Like the more tarantula you can get, the happier I become. However, I build it up so much that I can feel my mascara. That should tell you something. I put on two coats of this and I don't feel anything on my lashes. So to say that it is airy and cloudy is a super fair statement and easy to apply. So this is one of the benefits of doing these PR unboxing for you guys because I wouldn't have discovered that Flower Beauty has a new mascara at Ulta. And now I'm like, ooh, cloudy, airy mascaras. It doesn't make me blink this much. I'm just trying to make an emphasis on my lashes and I'm doing a really poor job of that. What's on my lips right now? As much as I'm like team raisin lips and the ultra matte lip look is not my favorite, I am a sucker for a really good nude lip. And if it's a matte lip that doesn't shrink on your lips, it has like a powdery finish, it's comfortable, Sign me up. So the Bare Minerals Lasting Matte in Lucky. Let me tell you, I'm feeling lucky right now wearing this lip color. I can't with the corniness, you know, like I just can't help myself, but it's beautiful, very pretty. Okay, I discovered this guy at Ulta when I was doing my purchases for their sale, and it's the Skylar Hair and Body Mist. I didn't need it. I don't need hair and body mist. I don't because I got this or I wear perfume, but I was like a hair and body mist. This would be really cool for like those days you're in a hurry. You're like, oh my God, the kids are about to be out of school and you're still in your pajamas in your hair. You still smell like pillow. And so they have three different scents. I think there's a yellow and a blue bottle. I picked the pink one. It's peach, osmanthus and sandalwood. Smells good. I would love for my hair to smell this way, you know, like, yeah, it's just, it's just pretty. Like, no, yeah, it's, it's just my shampoo. Like, it's nothing, nothing in particular. I think that's one of the reasons why I like native products so much as well is because their scents aren't like assaulting. They're just scents that you would normally smell somewhere and be like, wow, that smells good. It's not like, mm, at your nose. It's not attacking you. So wanted to share that and it's a clean brand at Sephora. Did I need this? No. Is it fall and winter precisely? Does this smell like summer? Yes. Is it seasonally appropriate? No. Do I care? Also no. Wow. Limited edition Rio Radiance Mist from Sol de Janeiro is a solar scent that combines clean white florals, creamy coconut milk, and the warmth of sun on the sand. That's exactly what it smells like. I was gonna try and describe it to you, but So de Janeiro saved you guys, so please thank them. <laughs> you don't want me to describe things, you guys. So anyway, it's, it's limited edition. My friend Edema almost got it too, but she's like, no, I'm not gonna use it until the summer. I was like, is there a law? Is there a law that prohibits me from using certain scents? No, I'm, I wanna smell like this. I'm gonna smell like this whenever. I can still smell this one. Smell this one? Mmm, yeah, that's nice. Actually, you know what I should do? Let's do a spray test. Black sweater, mist. Did you see that? I know. Okay, how many spray-on deodorants tell you they're spray-on deodorants? I tried using one once, and I remember doing this and going like this. And behind me, the wall that I was standing on, it was like a cutout of where the mist overflowed. It's like a crime scene outline. And I was like, no, that's not, that's not the kind of life I want. I want something invisible. Thank you, native. <laughs> All right, my hairs. 
What's in my hairs right now? All right, I'll tell you what's in my hairs. This is the Living Proof Curl Enhancer for Waves. This is a conditioning styler. I did an Ulta haul not too long ago, it was quite a bit ago, where I bought the cream styler and I bought the curling gel. So this is a cream styler for waves. The other one claimed to be a gel for curls. I do like the gel, but if I want my curls to look a little bit more effortless, almost like it air dried pretty. Like this is not effortless. I have to like pray, talk to her pretty, take her to dinner, buy her a gift if I want her to just even remotely look effortless. However, this guy here has become my best friend because it's a very lightweight cream. I put a couple pumps in the palm of my hand and then I work it into my hands and I don't scrunch. I feel like when I scrunch, that's when my hair looks the worst. So I'll just gently kind of apply some and then sort of, you know what I mean? Like just kind of just stroke her in the right direction. And then this happens. Look at how pretty this one is, right? So I love the fact that it is a cream because it's not going to be shiny or crunchy. But usually when I try to use a cream, because my hair is so fine, it just pfft, sags. Sags, sinks, and looks greasy. This one, it doesn't even look like I have anything in my hair, but it's all this. And like all living proof things, it smells amazing. It does, it really does. Anyway, that is it for my favorites. I really wanted to like just concentrate it into like a really beautiful package because I feel like sometimes with, with favorites, they can get a little random, a little weird. I mean, that's probably my favorite part about favorites is when they get weird. This one, this one feels good. You know, it's, it's very, it's useful. Like you might need a trimmer. You might want, you didn't, maybe you didn't know the story about the bee or you are three baby hairs and want your curls to not be heavy. All right. So if you guys want more information on the native promo, there will be a link in the description box below along with the promo code coffee break two. Now's your chance. Take advantage. You guys get the best sellers pack. You can build your own for 24 bucks shower from start to finish. So you're going to smell good. You're going to feel good. You can psh, 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 carry this guy. You know what I should do is I should get like maybe one or two more scents of this guy. You know what I mean? So because like maybe I'm not feeling peachy that day. Maybe that day I want to smell a little bit more uh, coconut vanilla, like vanilla coconut. Maybe like mint, cu oh, mint cucumber, you guys. The deodorant, the best. When we go on trips, we pack that one and Parker and I share deodorant. I know. Is that romantic or gross? I don't know. I think it's pretty romantic. Anyway, all the information will be listed in the description box of this video. All the links, all the everything, everything, the jumper, the book, it will all be listed there. And uh, thanks Native for sponsoring us one more time. We do appreciate it. I love you guys so much. And you know what to do if you found this video useful, entertaining, and learned something. Please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, this coffee break is over. Bye guys.